Hello! In this video, you will learn how to perform operations on multiple cells at the same time using array formulas. For the examples in this lesson, we will be using the widget sales data set. Here we have sales data for two fictional stores and nine different widgets. One powerful feature of Excel is its ability to manipulate multiple arrays of data by simply using a single formula. This is particularly useful when you need to perform the same calculation on many rows or columns in the data set. Not only will it save you time from copying formulas across multiple cells, but it will keep your workbook smaller and make it more difficult for the data to be accidentally changed. Entering an array formula is slightly different than entering standard formulas in Excel. First, instead of copying array formulas across cells after you enter them, you must select the cells for output before you enter the formula. Second, you only enter the array formula once, in the first cell. Third, once the array formula has been entered into the cell, you must hit Control shift and enter to create the array formula. Simply hitting enter will not work. If you do not use control shift enter here, you will need to delete the existing formula and start over. You will know that an array formula was entered correctly because it will be enclosed in curly braces after you hit control shift enter. Finally, one thing to keep in mind is that array formulas cannot be altered in individual cells once they are entered. If you need to make a change, you can only do so for the entire array, or you will need to start over. Let's begin by using an array formula to calculate the sales revenue generated by each product sales in each store. To do this, we need to multiply the unit sold by the unit price. Click on G1 and enter Revenue. Now select cells G2 to G19 to hold the output of your array formula. Next, enter the following formula. Equals C2 to C19 multiplied by D2 to D19. After you've entered the array formula, make sure you hit Control plus Shift plus Enter. So hold down Control and Shift and then hit Enter to complete the array formula. Now, if you highlight any cell in the formula, you will see the same formula enclosed in curly braces in the formula bar. Let's do another example and compute the sales commissions earned at each store. We can do this by creating an array formula to multiply the sales revenue in column G by the commission proportion in column E. Click on H1 and enter Earnings. Now select cells H2 to H19 to hold the output of your array formula. Enter the following formula equals the range G2 to G19 times the range E2 to E19. And be sure not to just hit enter, but you must hold down control and shift and then hit enter. Now you have the results showing how much the salespeople at each store earned from commissions on the sale of each product. And you've created this using an array formula in Excel. Again, you can see the curly braces in the formula bar indicating that this is an array formula. This has been an example of entering and using array formulas in Excel. I'll see you in the next video.